Cashless vending has increased our profitability. I'm, I'm, I'm certain of that. We are operating 60 cashless machines that's cashless only. And that's spread out over five hotels uh, in the Washington, D.C. metropolitan area. We chose these hotels because they were being vandalized on a, a, a repetitive basis. And we wanted to stop that. And we, wanted to, we, we, didn't, we didn't want people taking our money in it. We tried all kinds of deterrents to try to get the uh, machines protected. And we learned very quickly that locks keep honest people out. And they just don't work uh, on people that, want, that are, that are you know, going to get in. If they're going to want to get in that machine, they're going to get in. OK? So that was where we're coming from. The biggest plus by going cashless is by removing the dollar bill validator and by removing the coin mechanism and replacing it with a credit card, instantly stopped the vandalism to the machines. The, the shrinkage went away. There was no money to take anymore. Um, as far as the vandalism to the machines, uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars over a period of a year, that number went to zero immediately. Uh, we also are, are realizing a big savings in that at least 95% of our repairs revolve around coin mechanism jams and dollar bill jams. Well, without that equipment in the machine anymore, there are no jams at all. So we're saving, sending our technician and the way gas prices have gone up in the last two or three years, we're not, we're not spending money on gasoline sending a technician to those hotels anymore. We've had very little downtime uh, with the wireless system. We made sure that before we made a final decision on where we were going to put these cashless only machines, uh, that it had a good strong signal. And so we tested that thoroughly. If that signal is marginal or weak, that can cause downtime. But as long as those signals are strong and they are in these properties where we are now, uh, we've had very, very little downtime. Our experience with the Priva. Uh, is one that uh, I'm very happy to talk about. We, uh, we've established good relationships with people that work at Apriva. Uh, the one thing that I've noticed more than anything else is how accessible the people at Apriva are and how responsive they are. We had worked with a previous provider before Apriva. And um, in that relationship, the settlements took place, I think, about once a week. Now with Apriva, our settlements are, I believe, every 24 hours, maybe every 48 at the most. So it's a big difference and it helps our cash flow uh, in a big way.